Hello again. Hello again. Hello. <laughs> Welcome to the Sick Robistic Path. My name's Angie and this is the the story of the queens. Yeah. The story of the queen. The story of the queens sounds a bit yeah. Maybe I need to change that. <laughs> the story of the queens. No, I like that because they are plural. This is really cool. This is where it's all going on. Okay, so if you don't know what I'm talking about with these cards, go back to the video that I did on the 19th and you will learn why I am doing this and yeah, everything. Not everything. <laughs> the reason I'm doing this, okay, the story is there. Anyway, so the Queens. I really like this. This is amazing. Burning bridges, burning bridges, and you don't give a shit. So this is, I would say this is one of the, the pinnacles, yeah, of this journey. If you were going up Everest, you'd be at Hillary's step, yeah. I've never climbed Everest, but I have studied it <laughs> quite thoroughly. <laughs> so this is, this would be Hillary's step, yeah. You're burning your bridges. And that's like, gone. You then can breathe. She's at the top of this amazing. In fact, there's, there's, that you can see, this is a bit, looks a bit like Hillary Steph actually. And that's the, the summit there, right there. Yeah. There's another bit to go. You can see it right there. But you're just taking a breath. You're enjoying it. Early morning sun. Yeah. This has been a journey. So you're enjoying this breath of fresh air. Yeah. <clears throat> this grounding here, this is a sunset. So again, there's a, a linear progression of time here. It's quite, I, I, these cards are quite amazing for describing this whole journey. It's amazing. Um, if you notice, so in this first card, she's wearing shoes. Yeah. And she's wearing the trousers. She's wearing the trousers. Yeah, she's got the shoes on. But it's, it's quite um, constricted compared to these other cards. So there's a breaking of constrictions here, whatever that may be. Yeah. So the last, if you like, the last hurdle. Yeah. Burning the bridges. Taking your shoes off because the rest of these cards, she has no shoes on. Yeah. So you're, getting, you're taking your shoes off and embracing this new aspect yeah <laughs> i love these cards i'm very excited about these cards anyway so grounding so you know you're enjoying this breath of fresh air this new perspective is phenomenal it's unlike anything you've ever seen but there's also some grounding going on here yeah but this card this card is just says it all really there's a connection to all things. Yeah. You have a very interesting sunset. This this could even be Shangri-La, I would suggest. You got the earth element, you got the water element, you got the air element, and you got the little bit of fire. You have the moon. And her face. Compared to the, uh, what was that? That was the nines. Nines or eights? I think it was, I can't remember, eights. Where the woman was holding the bird. Very different look on her face to this one. This one. Yeah, she could stay here forever. So. Yeah. This is amazing. And I love it. I'm going to be using these cards quite a lot, I feel. <laughs> now that I've got to the Queens, I can now put all the cards back in the deck and use the deck. Because <laughs> I had to keep them all. Go, go back to the video on the 19th and you'll understand what I'm talking about. Uh, I can now use these cards because I've, I've done these. I've done all these readings now. So, this is where we're going, folks. Yeah, this is where we're going. You might even already be able to feel that. 
So this was the, uh, there were six, six little piles all together. Um, so one of them will definitely um, be describing you, where you are in your journey. Okay. I hope this has helped. Thank you so much for listening to me ramble on. Um, yeah. I'll be back tomorrow. Thank you for being here. I know I've already said that, but thank you again. <laughs> uh, don't forget to thumbs up, all that other stuff. And don't forget, most especially, to stay fearless.